Hi, so this is Emerson Avila, and I decided to do my assignment four on Natalie Pfaff's scrapbook. The first page I want to go over is the one that she chose for week four, and she pasted a comic, a Calvin and Hobbes comic, to that page. Um, she described to me that she chose this because um, it was during the time we were going over what we consider art and what we don't. Um, and of course, comics are a form of art, um, at least in my consideration. But she also chose this because she drew a connection to how it's similar to propaganda and how propaganda was, in, was a way in which the public you know, perceived military and wartime. And she also drew a connection to her and her family. She said that, you know, uh, she often read and uh, looked over these comics with her dad and the rest of her family. Um, so it was really great to see uh, her draw that kind of connection to one of her pages. Um, another page that really drew my attention and was actually similar to my scrapbook in that way is the one where she acknowledged women veterans. Um, unfortunately, sexual harassment is, you know, super common for women in the military, and it's indicated on her scrapbook that it wasn't really publicly acknowledged until 2008, which is actually fairly recent. And, you know, this drew my attention because recently the documentary about Vanessa Guillen has come out, and if you haven't seen it, I recommend you do. It's definitely a hard watch, but... It definitely um, brought awareness to sexual harassment um, for women within the military and how difficult it is um, to be a woman in the military. Um, and unfortunately, it's not something that's often talked about, but you know, it does result in long-term um, consequences for women. And you know, I I thought it was important. Um, to go over because, you know, it's it's something that needs to be acknowledged. And when you look at recruitment ads, the military isn't going to disclose all of its flaws. And I think it's important to consider for women who are considering going into the military. And it was um, actually similar to my scrapbook because during the time that we were going over teddy bear patriarchy, um, I actually... Um, did a connection between women veterans and how, you know, it's so common for people to stereotype uh, men are the ones that are supposed to be doing the brave and courageous actions, doing the heavy lifting within the households when in fact women are doing just as much as men are these days. And, you know, for a long time. And so um, I was really glad to see her acknowledge those facts within her scrapbook page and the similarities between mine and her scrapbook. So yeah.